Welcome back, and you are now tuned in with the Fuller Fanatic. Today, I bring to the channel the Todd Bag Full Size Bodega. This is a steel craft production series, which I believe this replaced the mid techs, but nonetheless, it's a beautiful piece that I had to have in my collection. This is the gray, tumbled titanium, scallop textured, silver trimmed, milled handles. And the attention to detail and the high quality intricate patterns set a nice visual tone. This is only intensified by the Bodega's crossed hatch backspacer, accompanied by the jimping that's been milled into the lower section of the titanium backspacer. And the aesthetics continue with the Todd Bag signature pocket clip, as you can see here, containing a ceramic ball, which on these knives, the material of the pocket clip ball indicates the material used in the particular bodega's bearing system. So per this pocket clip, this bodega is utilizing ceramic IKBS, which will also be indicated on the flipper tab as well. While we're on the flipper tab, I might as well mention there is absolutely no jimping on the flipper tab. And with its angle in relation to the detent and the distance to the pivot, this is one hell of a snappy deployment. To be such a big blade, the travel on the deployment seems very short. Either way, the bearing system is great. The black two-tone hand rub satin flats with the signature Todd Bag fluted fuller that runs the length of the blade. And you know me being the fuller fanatic, I couldn't wait to give it a go. It's definitely something different to say the least. Snappy, yet responsive to almost any flick. Comfortable and extremely satisfying. The lockup audible is very loud and crisp with a unique lockup tone. And as for when flicking, lockup is the same. Solid and very consistent, unhindered like other fuller flippers that the flipper tab gets caught up on the hand's palm due to short handle length. In fact, the bodega's handle length enables me to do a never before attempted, for me that is, pinky finger flick. Yup, the detent and blade weight definitely allows it. All the flicks are made easy by the bodega. The thumb deployment via the fuller, the middle finger, and of course, my very favorite, the reverse ring finger flick. And I call it reverse because the blade is deployed in a downwards motion. The retraction on the bodega, well, I'll let it speak for itself. I'm not slowing down the video or doing any cheap editing parlor tricks, but rather just showing you the real drop shut action. Not this new thing people do that wiggle and shake shut and then say drop shut. But that's a whole nother separate issue and a separate video that I will be uploading shortly. The near frictionless action on the bodega's retraction is a sight to be seen if you've never witnessed that type of blade movement. The lock bar has a steel insert that's hardware is hidden due to it being screwed in from the inside. And this allows for a continuous unbroken flow of the signature fuller pattern along the upper portion of the lock bar, which is also accented in that satin finish. This is definitely the first time I personally think the lock side has outdone its show side counterpart. A very well thought out and executed design by the bags. And this is not my official review, but my initial thoughts, feelings, and pure excitement on adding this piece to my collection. Although these are currently no longer in production, I honestly encourage anyone on the fence about the bodega to get one. Rest assured, you won't be disappointed in any aspect of the bodega, from quality and build, fit and finish, and also attention to detail from design, through production, and finished product. And coming from handling and spending some time with a true custom bodega to owning this steel craft series, my conclusion is yes. A loud, definitive, spot on, hell yes. So please tune back in and join me for the official review and visual breakdown of the Todd Bag Steel Craft Series Bodega. And anyone who can point me in the right direction to finding a TB Steel Craft full size glimpse, please feel free to leave a comment down in the comment section below. Also, rate, share, and please subscribe. Signing off from the Fuller Fanatic.